Hey, what's up guys? Ben here. Welcome back to another IUITD video. Except this is IUITD2. Now, have enough room to lean and reach. That is a good idea. I will go do that. Uh, whoopsie daisy and wappa doo da doo. Okay, good. Mm -hmm. And. Alright. Alright. I shouldn't be bumping to anything but the table. So. Alright. Let's go. Now, one of the reasons I bought this game was because it's IYTD2. Alright, it's the second version. Um. The second reason why I bought this game is because, uh. Well, you'll see. In with probably within the next couple minutes. Agent? Never mind. Can you hear me? No, don't yeah. worry, the briefcase is safe. Do you remember what happened? Ah, uh, your memory might be a bit patchy from the attack. Well, take all the time you need. You're back at headquarters and you're perfectly safe. You'll find a tape on the desk in front of you. Load the tape <laughs> into the projector console on your right. Now, I imagine you might recognize that bomb disposal device in front of you Whoa. from your time as a cadet. In fact, it, given the wear and tear, it might be the same one. Well, I'm sure it still works. Now, let's see. How do I... Ah, yes, there it goes. No, just a bit further now. Right, disarm this bomb, if you would. Wonderful! Yes! Next, the machine should dispense a grenade for you. Ah, there it is. Let's use it to test out that telekinetic implant of yours. Ah, good. Why don't you pick it up and bring it closer? Now, try using your telekinesis. Yes, exactly. Good, your telekinesis is still working. <laughs> I hear that when those things oh, malfunction, it's bomb? usually very messy. Bomb. Now to dispose of that grenade. Use your telekinesis to place it inside the blast chamber. Shut the door and then pick up that remote detonator so you can explode the chamber's corner. Yeah, you've got it. Shut up. I'm, I'm, my, my headset's perfectly fine. Good. <laughs> Good. For your final test, you will need to dispose of three more explosives hidden around the examination room. Good luck. I left you a list, so you know what you're looking for. I suggest you hover the clipboard nearby, so you can refer to it as you can... Ah, good. Search the exam room, Agent. Find and dispose of every explosive. Excellent. I'll make a special note regarding your technique. Well done. That would be one. Good work, Agent. You've passed all of the tests with flying colors. I've got just about everything I need. Don't worry, Agent. I've got everything under control. I don't think so.
I can see you play your cards right, kill your stage fright. This could be you. Give all the world a stage. Let's set it on fire. So you be the spy and I'll be the liar. <laughs> Makes a killing, they reveal me. That beautiful mask you wear is all I desire. So you be the spy and I'll be the liar. Face to face to face again. And through the camera lens we ascend. Major star, ha! The credits are more than just the end. Oh, because the truth is, I despise you. I will tear apart all these works of art that disguise you. I'm making the final cut. It's down to the wire. So That's you'll be the spy, and I'll be the liar. Howard's a smart guy, all right? He's very good with machines. But uh, sometimes he, uh, you know, sometimes uh, he gets uh, stuck. Things stuck. Yeah. So maybe he's not that good. I know this van isn't as luxurious as your old office, but we can't let Zoraxis know you survived your last mission. You've got a knack for putting a wrench in Dr. Zor's plans, so Zoraxis employees may not react kindly if they recognize you. On the bright side, now you've got a mini-fridge. As usual, Zoraxis Corporation is up to something vile and nefarious, but we haven't been able to figure out what. The Prime Minister is certainly making himself a target. Keep an ear to the radio agent. You never know what they might let slip. Now, your briefing materials should be arriving any second. Ah, where's that blasted courier? Ha! Oh. Speak of the devil. Take the cartridge from the tray on your right and load it gently into the cartridge viewer in front of you. Yeah, yeah. I guess, I guess not. Um, hmm. yeah, what's this? ID number, affiliation code, section 2. Okay, I don't give a shit. Wait, should I be giving a shit? I don't know. Whatever. John Juniper as Prince Prospero. Protect at all costs. Okay, cool. Now. Load it gently. Now, our intel oh, indicates the Prime Minister is attending an event in Manhattan tonight. My instincts say Zoraxis will try something there. And my instincts are only wrong about half the time. Oh, and the event is hosted by Hollywood actor John Juniper. <laughs> oh, I'm such a fan. Amazing. His performance in Marigolds of Forever was so... Uh, <clears throat> excuse me. Let's get you undercover so we can Whoops. figure out what Zoraxis is up to. Right. Marigolds are forever. Okay, guess what? Four days ago. <laughs> My instincts were right. 
This place is crawling with Zoraxis operatives. Now, you're all set up backstage. Maintain your cover as a stagehand until you can find and disable the threat. I managed to snag a ticket to the show, so I'll keep an eye on the Prime Minister. You know, for a man who could launch 50 nukes with the push of a button, he's much more grandfatherly than I expected. Well, find out what Zoraxis is up to. Attention, stage crew. Today's the big day. If anything goes wrong with my play, well, remember what happened to that sound designer. Wait, what happened to Jerry? Is Set he... the stage, everyone. Oh, I want an impeccable him? performance from all of you. Oh, you up there, up in the catwalk. Be sure to follow the new instructions what? I left on your clipboard. That voice sounds familiar. Stay on your guard, Agent. Banners down. Oh! Check the back of my notes. Oh! 1967 event was here. 2112. Oh, crossbow. Bet. And a buckler. Oh! Oh! That's it. Oh! Probably important. Ooh, darts. Okay, so come the hour is late, the great clock down the hall. Uh, clock gong coming, coming in winter winds blow them wide. Is wind something? Something, something is not Oh! That would explain. Don't raise that curtain before we're ready. <laughs> I will resort to violence. Oh, that's not very reassuring. Something is mass descent, something is fog. I think we should keep these out just in case. Because if there's weapons, there's definitely a in case. Ooh. Um. No. Oh. No, no, that's not a good look for you, love. It's completely wrong for the shape of your face. Maybe if you. <clears throat> no, not the time. Back to work. Oh. Stage is set. Raise the curtain. Oh. Ready for Juniper's spotlight. That's John Juniper in the flesh. Oh, Agent Aya. Well, I'm sure you can handle things from here. Uh. Don't touch 
the mask. I've taken care of it. Uh, bleh. I'm dead? What the? Great. Replay. Whoopsie daisy, I meant to do that, 100%. <laughs> Whatever Zaraxxus is planning will be backstage. Find the threat and take it out without blowing your cover. <laughs> Attention stage crew, today's the big day. If anything goes wrong with my play, well, remember what happened to that sound designer. I would like to know what happened to the sound oh, designer. we're almost ready to go. Keep an eye on your cue light. I'll turn it on when we're ready Ooh, for curtain up. What? Uh... Yep, yeah, I'm raising it. Ready for Juniper's oh. spotlight. Yep. Good evening, everyone. Now, I know what you're thinking. John, these tickets cost more than my yacht. This better be good. I also want to take the opportunity to make a special announcement. I've got something oh. new in production. Can't say too much yet, but I can safely say that you've never seen anything like it. For tonight, though, let's move on to the main event. I'm lowering the mask. Stage two team, get to your positions. Gas masks on. Oh, I do not like the look of that mask, Agent. Welcome, honored guests. We may live in an age of turmoil, but fear not. This castle is solidly built. These strong walls and welded gates will seal us away from the horrors that await us outside. Come. The hour is late, but the masquerade is just beginning. Can't you hear the toll of the great clock down the hall? Come in. Come in. Guards, shut and bar the doors, lest these foul winter winds blow them wide to uninvited visitors. Oh. It's hard to shake the chill, isn't it? Though I just had the vaguest sensation of another presence. Did you come alone? <laughs> you think no. this one's next? No. Surely we're still safe within these walls. <clears throat> it's time! Extraction teams, engage on my signal. Don't draw attention to yourself, Agent. You're a stagehand, remember? Deploying gas. Now. I think that was right. This is not part of the show. Everybody run. What? My mask. Zaraxxus employees, change of plan. <laughs> Find whoever did this. I want them dead. I knew that voice was familiar. Agent, she's a Zoraxis operative, known as the Fabricator. That is not an idle threat. Stay alive until I can get an evac team to you. Hey, the agent's on the catwalk! Those are Zoraxis trained operatives. Uh, it's them, or you, Agent. I've got a lock on the agent! Lock the exit! I'm on it. I'm covering the lift.
Hugs from the target. I've got a clear line of sight. Hang on, agent. Just two left. Oh. Oh. Okay. Oh. Well, I think that's the last of them. What I the lost hell? sight of the Prime Minister in the chaos, but I think he made it out. Uh, no sign of the fabricator either. Well, let's debrief back at the van. Okay. All right. That was not fun. Oh, this is fun. Well, you did it. The Prime Minister's safe, and I hope John Juniper got out too. Although, well, something feels off. That stage manager, the fabricator, well, she's a nasty piece of work, but she doesn't usually take center stage in Zorax's plans. Very strange. Hmm, hmm, interesting. What is strange is the fact that there's wine! Or whatever this hell this is. Normally, you don't give me that. Anyways, who the hell cares about that? Oh, what? No, no, no. Well... It's a nice sound of boom. I did it. Egypt, I've been listening to the radio. The Prime Minister completely reversed his stance on Zaraxxus. Do you think they got to him? Well, our team has been doing routine follow-ups with the cast and crew of the play. And, Ooh. well, check your briefing. You're not going to believe this. John Juniper here. Oh, I'm so glad you called. Yes, I do have information on the attack, but is it safe for me to tell you over the phone? No, I can't. I left for Europe this morning. How about this? I've got an autonomous jet at JFK. If you send someone to the airport, they can come meet me. Well, lucky you. A ride on a private huh. jet and a meeting with John Juniper when you get to Europe. Have a safe flight. Find out what he knows. I'm going to see if headquarters will let me come along. Something tells me my flight isn't going to be safe considering this is a mission. <laughs> Let's go. Three days ago. It's not fair you're the only one who gets to meet John Juniper. I had no small part in thwarting the theater attack, you know. The head office really doesn't understand the complexity of the... Signal lost. Oh, were you on a different call? Sorry about that. Unregistered signals tend to cut out at these altitudes. I can keep you company till you get here, though. Let's see. I can have my man Gibson pick you up in four hours. What's that? In the meantime, I can see you're settling in. Please, make yourself comfortable. Why don't you order something to eat? This is my personal aircraft, and I like to keep it well stocked. By our Zoraxis top chef? Fuku Nagiri. Four. Two. Passenger identification failed. Initiating elimination protocol. I can't believe this. My flight staff forgot to shut off the security system. I am so sorry. I'll need to have a word with them. Whoa! 
Defense, defense, I don't want to die. The chefs in the world can prepare that dish safely. Lucky for you, I employ the best chefs. <laughs> oh, what the? Right, well, you go there. Excuse me? Oh. <coughs> I guess his chefs didn't prepare it safely. Okay, so. You, something over there, and you. It's not fair you're the only one who gets to meet John Juniper. Oh, okay, I had that's... no small part in thwarting the theater attack, you know? The head office really doesn't understand the complexities of the Signal okay. lost. Please make yourself comfortable. Why don't you order something to eat? This is my personal aircraft, oh. and I like to keep it well stocked. Well stocked indeed. Let's try out everything. Whoopsie daisy. That's not fun. Lighter. Here's another important thing. I think I just broke one. Hmm. Interesting, interesting taste. Interesting indeed. Some interesting tastes. Uh, I prefer it like this, though. Oh yes, please. Why do you have so much? Okay. Um. Oh yes, please enjoy. I picked up a new box of these just for you. You mean this? You know, I'm starting to think that this John Juniper guy isn't a very nice person. I'm starting to think that all of these are sort of dangerous. The juicy It's not fair you're the only one who gets huh? to meet John Juniper. I had no small part in thwarting the theater attack, you know? The head office really doesn't understand the complexities of the Signal lost. Fair trade. Please make yourself you comfortable. Get chocolate, you Why don't get you order that. something to eat? This chocolate. is my personal aircraft, and I like to keep it well stocked. Right. I trust your drinks, I don't trust you.
tells me. That's my personal property, Agent. It's of no use to you, I promise. Oh, you found the emergency supplies. Ha, <laughs> safety first. In all seriousness, that's sensitive equipment. Go close that back up. Probably here. Uh, how about you go piss off? And you just in general shit. What the numbers be? How do we activate the security system again? Isn't that the explosion one? Okay, whatever. No, 
Yes, so we got Seville, Spain, Madrid, Spain, um, something Spain. Well, I guess... I have to restart. It's not fair, you're the only one who gets to meet John Juniper. I had no small part in thwarting the theater attack, you know. I had off What the Um Opus really doesn't understand the complexities. Okay, well, I'm going to uh, end the video right here, and then I'm going to be right back, yeah, actually, I'm probably just going to edit this, I don't know, I'm not, I can't edit, last time I checked, anyways, uh, yeah, uh, I'll, I'll be back in like, I don't know, a second. Bye.